just said, he said, I never heard the dogs bark. I don't know. Now. Uh, okay, guys, so we're back with Rick. Remember, this is the dog that's open for suggestion. He's looking for a suggestion. So all, all I'm going to do is go like this, and he's going to lay down. And I'm going to tell you what the... Uh, those puppies are so mad, they want to come back out. I'm going to tell you what triggered it. And if you look, it was, it was my hand more than it was... Um, Watch, he's going to see my hand. I don't even really have to be looking at him. You know, I mean, if, if human beings were contraptions, then that's how they operated. We figure out vending machines. You've got to think of yourself as somewhat, you know what I mean? <laughs> if you knew that if you went in front of a vending machine, am I wrong? No, no. Just did little dance moves and it just started. You no, know. yeah. So, you know, I'm, I'm just cultivating the two, the, you know, this part of the dog separately. And it was just kind of accidental. But I'm cultivating this separate from the movement, you know. But if you said, where would you go with that? Where I would go with it would probably end up being, I'd have my leash like this, and then the hand would drop like that. And then that would say, you know, here, you could even, you know, if you really had to dress rehearse it, if, if, you, if someone said, well, you can't put the leash on or do anything, not that anybody would do that. But these are the kind of, you know, contests and stuff they should have at this ICP thing. You know, for, uh, submit your fastest recall, submit your, you know, this, that, and the other. But I'm going to show you how you can do it. You can get him to get up first, because if he sees me getting up, he's moving. Um, you know, the way you would do it, and he's looking. If I, if, if, he's looking to do some, a little more than that, what he's doing, but if I get back here, he'll go back. Oh, you precious angel. So now I got him to down on the platform. I'm not sure that's what I wanted, but the way I would do it would be, like this. I'd have the leash in my hand and then go. When that was the suggestion. You know what I mean? And then later when the leash was And if you said how long is that gonna take, I mean it's gonna be long. But it's gonna it's gonna be forever. I mean that's that's what you have to look at. It's gonna be forever. Alright, so then we can put the leash on. You make it probably pretty fast, teach a reset. You gotta be careful with that though. Alright, look, so I'm hooking my leash to my car. And again, there's my move right there. If you said, well, he didn't see that. All right, let me see if I can try the drop in the hand thing here. Let's see if it works. Okay. You know, but that's what you have to realize. It's such a different... Right, but, those not, but I'm trying to do that separate. I'm really not trying to combine that. He kind of did that on his own. I just want to be ready. You know, and this is what, you know, and I think you guys, I mean, you need to practice standing in front of the mirror and completely collecting yourself. And if you said that isn't important, I'd say, yeah, it is. You know, so that you're now just an outline and say, where do I speak from here? That's what people have to do. They don't. They're, you know, you can't get your arm behind your back. Big no-no. You can't have your arms way away, I mean, for certain things, but, all right, so look, I'm going to get him back up there. Now, I want him to understand now we're going to move. So the precursor for movement should really be this, giving, giving slack to the leash, not pulling it towards. So that's your precursor. The hand drops. Pre. Word out of that turn. If you said, "Well, you're driving towards the turn," absolutely driving towards the turn. He's augmenting it right there with the little leaves. I'm going 
didn't say that why that wasn't good, because I, I need some more tree juice. Chris is like, uh oh. She's like, what can I pull out of my magic bag of tricks? You don't have any meat in there? I have my stamatis. Hook, line, and sinker. The moist and meaty. Right, but I want him to get up there, so this is what I do. I act like I'm going there. With that, you know, one day they'll put me away and say, she is crazy. And I will be like that episode of Seinfeld where they're, instead of not moving their hands, she overdoes it. Overall, better. You don't want to be in now with your leash and just... He already understands to fix it. I want to get him... Okay, so, you know, again, if you said what's your precursor for movement, slack. Okay. So what he's thinking right there is the augment. I'm, I'm driving towards the turn. This part, the jumping is causing the jump. Right, we don't have a cleanup crew up here either. That looks like it's on this one. You know, and it really is the same as the crash. It just, and I've got too much slack. Look, I need to shorten up my slack. There's my. There's my pivot point right there. You know, he said to himself, that thing can't help itself. It gives itself away every time it's going over to that platform by sticking its hand out. These things are ridiculous. You can see them sticking their hand out of the road. If you run ahead, no, but again, he said, what's the difference now? Uh, I'm going to add the slack. You know, if you said you're doing too much moving around, I'd say, you're probably not doing enough. I don't see the benefit of being able to move them around fluidly right around you then. Let me back. 